Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. Mm. And coffee. All right, I went to the doll, I went to several Dollar Trees and I ran into one of you guys and I'm sorry, I forgot to ask your name. I am so socially awkward and I wasn't getting too close because I was just getting over that stomach flu and I didn't want to spread it. Ugh, I was a mess, but Hi, and thank you for saying hi to me. I do love it when I meet you guys out in the wild. I'm just socially awkward. I know. I'm not sure what's happening. My skin is peeling. Okay, so I've got a Dollar Tree haul for you this week. Went to a couple stores. Even went to one out of town in a place called Heath, which is the town over from me. I had to run there for some other stuff. So let's go. I found their Giardelli um, Salted Caramel Brownie Cup Mug, excuse me, brownie in a cup. And this is a four pack for $1.25, thank you. And my Sarah will love that. And she's coming to uh, pet sit for me next weekend while I'm in Canada. And so, um, She'll have those while she's here. And then I found these. And this is a, I think it's a four, if I had to guess. Six pack of Evian Sparkling Feed Your Mind. It is magnesium, zinc, grapefruit, and basil. Sparkling waters. I'm excited to try these. And you get six cans for $1.25. I thought that was a fantastic buy. No particular order. Did I already say that? Oh, rocks. I bought these last year and I love them. So I grabbed three more packs. I use these and I want to show you the coloring of these rocks. I use them to top succulents because it looks pretty. And I'm sure there's other reasons, but it looks pretty. And so I grabbed three packages. I think that should be enough. I have to transplant my, that's a bird's nest and it has a baby on the side. So I need to fix that up and I'll need more rocks. So I grabbed three, if I need more, I can go back, but I like the um, multicolors in that. So that'll just stay down here. Um, yeah, and if you're interested, I'll bring you along when I'm transplanted. I grabbed two packs of these. These are Pop Rocks gum, crackling gum. Um, so each packet turns into a into gum instead of just Pop Rocks. Um, and these are going into a goodie bag for my retreat for some special folks. And they're only 25 calories, six carbs. Eww. But you get three packs in each one of these. So I thought that was super fun. I need to put that over here. And then I found in the children's size gold toe socks. This is a three pack, $14 retails for. And I think it's two pair of navy, no, navy, this blue gray and a black pair of dress boys, just boy socks. Uh, for my friend who has a little guy, I think these should fit him. If not, she can pass them along. Um, nope, this is both navy blue. I lie. It's navy blue and then this. I love that color. Anyway, those go over there with the bag of stuff I'm taking. I didn't get to go meet my friends last weekend because I was sick. Now, I found these in their Gildan black t-shirt, just plain black with the v-neck, but is it a women's or, oh, it is a ladies. I hope it fits. It's a ladies. It should fit. I want to do, um, an iron on. And so I grabbed two of the black because in case I make a mistake, yeah, these are both ladies and the two X. And then this is also a ladies 2X and I just got it in white. So I need to do it this week or next week, but I'm going, so when I get back from Canada, 
the following weekend, I'm going to Cincinnati just for an afternoon. Uh, J.R. Ward is an author of some books that I read, my favorite books that I read. And she is having an event. You had to buy, and I think it's still available, but you buy a book and you get entrance into her author speak at this hotel in Cincinnati. And then she talks about the next book that's coming out in the series, which is exciting. So I will be there. And if any of you are there, let me know in the comments below. Because I think that would be so exciting to run into somebody. And I'll try not to be so, yeah, me. Can't help it. Um, I grabbed a pack of three, or triple A, I'll energize your batteries. It's a two pack. I think what I need is triple is the triple A, but if not, I'll use them. My cable remotes take triple A, but um, I'm on the board of my condo association. I just was elected secretary, so I have to use the recorder and type out the notes. So. I needed backup batteries. And then I grabbed from my girl, Sarah. Sarah's my niece. She's a high school English teacher. Oh, also, thank you all who have connected with her through Etsy. She is having so much fun. Um, if you're not aware, Sarah, my niece, has an Etsy store, and it's called Blind Date in a Box, what she has on there. So you sign up for it. I think it's $20. You tell her your interest in books. She'll add some little goodies in there as well and send you a surprise book to read. So the link is in my description box always if you're interested. But in July, she and her girlfriends or two of her friends are going to Florida for a three-day or four-day or whatever. I don't know. So I grabbed some of these. I got one of the Pretty in Pink and two of the Very Berry color. Now, if we've all seen these, but the difference between this specific one and the ones I'm finding in the box, this has a 15 SPF in it, and I'm all about the SPF. So I got each one of the girls a little chapstick, hydrating, SPF. Let's, come on, nobody needs sun cancer. And then I got them these, which I think are adorable. These are face masks, and the brand is Bio Miracle. I don't know the brand, but whatever. And ice cream face mask, creamy milk and honey. This is soothing and moisturizing. Hi, Alex. This is cooling and refreshing, and it has peppermint in it. I'm putting these in their little goodie bags, too. And this one is cupcake, purifying and refreshing. Um, I don't know. I think it's cruelty free. I don't know. I think so. So these are just some of the little things that'll go in each girl's little bag. And then I think I'll get them some treats and that's there. They should be done for their little bags, but who knows? I'll show you when I put them together. I finally found one of these pots that says flower market established 1953. Check them out because some of them are be pretty banged up. Um, like this one has a sharp spot. It doesn't matter to me though. I'm just going to stick a pot in it. I'm not going to plant in it, but I'm going to take a pre-existing potted plant and just drop it down in there in its nursery pot, probably. But I wanted some of these because I just think they're fine. And I'll keep it in this so it doesn't make creepy noises. I can't wait to get into my um, planting stuff, but just a little early. Okay, we found, oh, I did find some fun stuff. Now, I found this one. Okay, this one also has the SPF. So, it, I don't know, this is the first one I found, but I think it's this shape over the lipstick tube shape that has the FPF, SPF in it, because I grabbed another one for me. Because I said, girl, you need one too. And this is also the Very Berry. So we should just see what color it is, shall we? I know I need to wear lipstick. Ah. Oh. I like that color a lot. That's a good color for me. The light pink is not a good color. 
Hi, Alex. Do you want to say hi? Hi. Come here. Oh, this is the fat one. Say hi. Oh, squeak. He said, no, 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 no. Can't see my face. All right. You're okay. You're okay. So I like that. And it feels very smooth. I found these old-fashioned motel keys. Guys, they're killing me. And if you're my age, you know what these are. And this one said, good vibes only. But what I'm wondering is if I can take maybe some nail polish remover and get this off and then I can decorate them myself. I don't know. And this one says, take it easy. And this one says, living the dream. So I don't, I mean, I can't feel the texture of this paint. So I'm wondering if it's just melted into the plastic. And there was one other one. I just, I don't remember what it says, but it didn't resonate. So I grabbed these because these are fun, guys. I remember these keys. I actually have one hanging, a real one from a hotel I worked at that we found when we were doing renovations. It was in the wall. <laughs> but I got these because I just think they're fun. Hi, Alex. What, what is the matter, sir? I know, I picked you up. And then they have the Eco Gang, and these are floss picks, you get 40, but these are um, vegan and free from PFAs, BPA, thread mode of PE, don't even know what that means. Um, stop, they're bamboo. We should open them, because they're for me, so. Um. I like a floss pick. Alex, stop. This cat is ridiculous. No. Oh, they smell like mint. Ooh. It feels like a plastic to me, but it's a bamboo plastic, and it's biodegradable. And it's just a, a floss, you know, a flosser. They smell good. I love the smell of mint. And they're vegan in case anybody needed to know. So I grabbed those just to have. And then I found this interesting. This is Brush Buddies Herbal Charcoal Toothpaste. It's supposed to help whiten your teeth naturally. I don't know if I've talked about it here, but I, I use a, for my everyday toothpaste, I use a um, prescription brand for my doctor, and it's like $18 a tube. But every couple days, uh, in the morning, I will use a whitening. It smells like, I don't know, but it's black. I cannot make out what that smell is. I've smelled it before. Um, it says cool mint. I guess it is a mint, but it almost like a black, almost like a licorice mint, something different. But anyway, we'll see how it, do, it does. Um, just because of the amount of coffee that I drink, I try to use, um, with my dentist knowledge, every couple morning, like every other, every third morning, I use a whitening toothpaste. And not the high fluoride one that she has me on to help with some very expensive dental work I've had done. All right, we got two bags, three bags left. Two bags, three bags, I don't know. Ooh, okay. I found, this is Spa Scriptions, and they're under eye patches. And you get five pairs, five pair. And the company is Spa Scription. Um, I was gonna try to open it, but it's sealed shut pretty good. I get bags, okay, I'm just ripping the box open. I get bags under my eyes, uh, especially for my allergies, but good Lord. Okay, oh nice, so you get five individual packages and it's cucumber under eye pads, spa scription. I'm gonna try one tonight what they look like so if you're having like a get together or you want to do like a pampering night you get five in here five sets individually packaged so you know you can share them 
if I like them, maybe I'll send one of these with the girls too. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Oh, I found these and these are exciting to me, but uh, the lady threw them all on top of each other. So, oh, hold on. And we've all seen them, but this is the first time I saw them at my store. So they had a pink one, a blue one, and I got the cream. I wanted all the same shape, but I want different colors. I have three shelves on my wall and each shelf is gonna get one of these and then some other decor to go with it. But these are fun and they are metal and they have their own little um, hanger. So I could put, I could hang it, but I think, I think it'll sit on a shelf as long as I do it gently. But these are the three colors in this shape that they had. They did have um, a different shape, but I liked the softer, more rounded thumbnail. Oh, I'm getting new glasses in a couple weeks too, guys. Got a new prescription. So that's good. Oh, I found this and I bought two. Uh, but first coffee. I think I showed you the other one already. It's a luggage tag, uh, but yeah. And then they had a Volkswagen bug looking one, or be, a Volkswagen bus looking one too. I love these. I think they're fantastic. And for $1.25, this is totally worth it for me. Um, maybe I'll use this one as a luggage tag. I, hi. Hi. Okay. He's trying to roll me over. He wants me to move now. My boy is like a bull in a china shop, in case anybody needs to know. I grabbed one more of these for my car. I will tell you, I used the other one already with the yellow bag, and they are perfect. Perfect for what I need. It's just a little bag to grab my tissues, whatever, in my car. And when I get out, I can take the bag with me, wrap it up, and throw it in the trash, and then I'm not leaving the trash behind. And also, I still stand behind that it would make a good barf bag, even though I'm not barfing anymore. <laughs> so I grabbed that um, for my little gift bags that I'm putting together. I just grabbed a pack of these. I can make them, but you know, they're just as easy to buy them already done. So I have six of those that will go over here. Hi, Alex. Hi. Yeah, you got a leg? You want me to scratch your belly? Okay. Um, I got a Simply Spa Bath and Body Care Charcoal Infused Exfoliator. We can open this too because it's for my shower. And I always wonder what these things are. Okay, okay. Oh, so it's a sponge, but it's a little rough. So in the shower, I like to get the dead skin off, especially in the summertime. And it's charcoal infused. I really don't know what that does, but there's a sponge in here. Yeah, that's exciting. I will totally use that in the shower. My other one is time to throw it away. Gotta throw the other one away, right? All right. Trying to figure out what I'm doing here, guys. I've got crap everywhere. Okay. Let's take you out. We'll keep this handy. Maybe if I leave it right here, I'll remember to put it on before my videos. All right. This bag here... So I told you that I wanted to do my kitchen in bees. It says bee leave. It's one of those, they, they came out with these at Christmas time uh, with the snowman and stuff. And it has a little light on it. I don't know that I will uh, use the light to be honest with you, but maybe, I don't know. But I think it's just gonna sit up on a shelf. Isn't that fantastic? Oh, can you see it with the little beehives? And this is that like MDF wood. And I love it. And yeah, I can, I know the light goes on. I just don't. Oh, is it turned off? They're getting smarter than us. So yeah, I could turn that on. Has a light down in there and it's a nice yellow light. So instead of having an on off switch, this one has a turn. It like turns. Oh, I love it. I'm so excited for my bee kitchen. 
And then to go on the shelf with these pretty flowers, look at this little bird. Like what? Isn't that adorable? Can you just see this probably with this one up on a shelf? Like just being as happy as can be. I know, right? That's what I got it for. Okay, Alex, you're okay. Um, I didn't see any other colors, but I can't imagine that they don't come in other colors. And it's a little chubby bird, too. I can't imagine that they didn't come in other colors. My store just only had those colors. When I was shopping, then I found some new fabrics. Guys, like what? I think these two are the same. We're going to open them up and find out. Um, this was in a bag, a box of just random textiles. I'm not even saying fabric. I mean, it was all fabric, but it all is different. This is like a, almost like a linen or a tapestry, really, almost. Sorry, I got the trash bag open here. Okay, but look at this. Oh, tell me this is not everything. Guys. This is my whole aesthetic on a piece of fabric. What? And then for the inside, I'm going to make a bag. This, It's coming out definitely more bright on mine, but it is a chartreuse. And then I'll get like a black zipper. Oh my gosh. So I think these two are going to end up being the same fabric. Yeah, I think so. Ooh, let's see. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see if I can line them up and make them be the same. So I grabbed two of this one and two on the inside so that I can create. And then I only had one of this one in the more pastel-y summer, which I love too. I love a stripe. So I grabbed them, but the, the feeling this, I mean, it's cotton, but it feels, it feels more like a, a linen cotton or a brocade almost. It definitely has more texture than a silky cotton. So I was so excited. Oh, sorry. When I saw this box of fabric, I kind of went deep diving in it. I pulled it out and started digging. So I don't know if I'll have time before my trip, but definitely this will become some type of a project bag or a makeup bag or something. For me, I'll take it upstairs. And then the last bag I think is mostly candy. This one I did open to share with a friend, but it's the Strawberry Milkshake Cow Tails, and I'm taking this to Canada while well, I'm filling some goodie bags for some friends in Canada. Um, and I also got one more of the Starburst Jelly Beans for Canada. There's a couple people I'm putting things together. The Fruit Loop Jelly Beans, because why not? And then they have Warhead Sour Taffy. And one of the people that I'm, I'm putting together is a gentleman. And so I am, and I got him a piece of chocolate from Anthony Thomas with his initial on it because that is super fun. So I'm going to put the candy in here, in this egg. And did everybody see the little like designs on the side? I just noticed it when I was purchasing it. This side has a little, but these, I mean, this is on here. I don't have to tape it or glue it. I will put a little piece of tape, but I squeezed it to get it open. Like if you squeeze here, it'll open. But if I just pull, I really have to squeeze it and pull it hard. And then maybe I'll tie a ribbon around it or something. But this is going to be fun. I'm going to fill it with all different kinds of candy. And share with our friends in Canada. And then I'm going to buy some candy from Canada and bring it back and share with my friends here. All right, guys, that is everything. I hope you enjoyed this week's Dollar Tree haul. Um, I will be going or coming back. I'm not sure when this is going up, but at some point I will be in Canada and I will take lots of footage and bring in my laptop. I doubt I load any videos when I'm there. If I, I don't think I'll have time. So I'm going to preload some videos before I leave for when I get back, if that makes sense. And then I will edit what I have when I get back. But maybe I'll put some short, uh, some shorts up. So watch 
uh, watch my channel and I'll put some YouTube shorts up while I'm up there. All right, guys, thank you so much. And I will talk to you later. Oh, and I just noticed. Well, let's just fix it for a second. Nobody told me my camera was crooked. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye.